Hello and a warm welcome from the English South Coast. This has always been an atmospheric venue, Fratton Park. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And we're ready to bring you live coverage of this League One fixture. It's Portsmouth and they take on Derby County. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Connor Hurahan. Collins. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. But then the one that goes astray. Now, who can he play it to? An incisive pass. And he might be in here. And thumped away. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. A short free kick this time. And the keeper had the measure of it. Playing it in. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. This to make it 1-0. And confidently converted. Well, here it is again. And just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. Now back underway. And 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Stearman Knight Smith now Mendes Lang and well, they're moving the ball neatly enough just looking for that decisive pass I think I spoke too soon wasn't the best of passes finally and the counter attack is on options available Tom Lowry and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Corey Smith. Howrahan. Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. Can they square the game? And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Oh, good chance, but he couldn't take advantage of it. Well, the stats show us that the hosts haven't had that much of the ball. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. There's a slide rule pass. Will he find the net? And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. And not a great challenge, free kick here. Max Bird. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Mendes Lang. It might be. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Fratton. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. And he takes on the shot. He scored once already and close to making it a double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. He's driven in the corner. 
On the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective... It's got to be! Just can't get it past him! Could be a chance to break here. And he's in. Can he find the net? And that is defending of the highest order. And he has options available. Now potential danger. And he's in the clear. Well, from that sort of range, he really should be testing the keeper. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. And time for the change now. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. David McGoldrick. Powerhan. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. 20 minutes to go in this one. And the counter looks on here, options available. A glorious chance. Oh, a finish of real class. No wonder he's celebrating. Take a bow. Well, I have to say that's a really composed finish. He had to get that absolutely right. He certainly did that. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Fifteen minutes left for play. Now, let's see what they can do here. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Well, there's a sound reason why we're focusing on him. He's making his presence felt in attack, Stuart. Well, he's been at his best today. He just seems to get his shots away so easily. And he's taken his goals really well. Brilliant stuff from him. And space to attack. There's a slide rule pass. Well, from close range, not ideal. So a personnel change then. Number three, Clay Forsyth. Substitution for Portsmouth, coming off the pitch, 26, Tony Lowry, to be replaced by... And continues his run. Could be! A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick! Well, as the replay shows us, this is the way to beat tight marking. Just look how he turns with the ball. That's a fantastic goal, you have to say. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Craig Forsyth. Well, three minutes of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Showing a lot of guile there. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Really needed to be spot on with the challenge inside the box. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent. Full of energy and pace. And the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance.